Mighty Lacombo, one-time champion. Vance Nevada, a 30-year veteran, a five-time All-Star Wrestling cha uh, Trans-Canada champion. He's held the title from around 2008 all the way to 2012 in various different reigns, defeating the likes, defeating Seth Knight, defeating Disco Fury, defeating Adam Ryder, defeating Massive Damage two times. Will the Mighty Low Combo be the next on the list? Will there be a brand new champion? I don't know if I would fall for this handshake there, Peter Brown. Vance Nevada, master of mind games. Lacombo, an honorary man and an honorary champion shaking the hand of his competitor. I mean, without a doubt, the, the mighty low combo has the strength advantage and the youth advantage, but Vance Nevada- Oh, wait a minute, oh! A minute. oh. Vance the has been wrestling all over Canada. Never take your eye off your opponent, especially in a championship match. But here we go, Lacombo going to work. You cannot match this man's speed, power, agility. He's got all the tools it takes to be. Whoa! One of the best wrestlers here in the Pacific Northwest. He carries championship gold right now, and he's been an amazing champion. And Vance Nevada is about to find out why as the Herculean physique of the mighty Lacombo pounds away over and over. Lacombo now sending Nevada for the ride, hard into the buckle. Here he comes, wham! Oh, splash. oh, what impact that was. Lacombo threw all of himself into Nevada, then big bad body drop! Send Mr. Beefy Goodness up and over. Lacombo wants another one. He feels like it's working out. He's got the magic touch right now. Gonna go for uh -oh. another back oh. Perhaps a mistake by calling your move before you do it. Vance Nevada must have scouted that and heard it. And reversed it just like that. Well, there's not a whole lot inside the squared circle that... Oh! Vance Nevada has not seen or heard. And everyone here in the Maritime Labor Center heard that shot. Well, the wrestling IQ of Vance Nevada is uh, second to none. Oh, boy. Oh! <laughs> Looks like he's going to work the back of the mighty low combo. Well, that was good for three points. We're still scoring this wrestling, right? I think I don't Vince know Nevada might that. be up now. It's a one fall to the finish. Nevada getting up close and personal with our referee, Robert Mitchell. Maybe unwise to uh, test the patience of the official in a championship match, but Nevada seems to be in control at the moment. Yeah, Vance Nevada just last year wrestled over 60 matches. Unbelievable. That's probably even more than the mighty Lacombo's entire career. And yet Lacombo holds championship gold. So it just goes to show that, oh, experience isn't everything. Well, Lacombo no doubt has the youth, has the un unbelievable strength. And we're seeing it right now, knife edge chop. Sends me, Mr. Beefy Goodness from one corner to the other. Lacombo following right up with another devastating chop. Could we be in for a third? Oh boy. Ah! All around. Gonna do a chop festival around the ring. Gonna go for a fourth here. Oh, quiet now, quiet. Oh, beefy goodness got out of the way. Lacombo maybe took a little too long. Nevada saw that coming. Doesn't want any more chops from Lacombo. Well, the more down and dirty this match becomes, I, I gotta say it's gonna favor the challenger. Pure strength. The more physical the match becomes, Lacombo obviously the favorite, but Vance Nevada has been plotting and planning for this one for a long time. 
and is trying to leverage Mighty Look almost passing against him. Watch out there, Rob, the photographer. Lacombo's back in serious jeopardy right now. Vance Nevada wants the All-Star Wrestling Trans-Canada Championship once again, wants to restore the luster, as he says, by defending it all across of, uh, from Canada. Nonchalant cover obviously is not going to finish off the champion, but... Now going to go for a rear chin lock. Still to come, our other main event, Sebastian Wolf will take on Austin Aries coming up right after this. But now, Locarbo fighting back. Shots, huge elbows to the midsection of Mr. Beefy. Goodness, oh. but Vance Nevada returns the favor by driving the knee, burying it right to the chiseled abs of the mighty Locarbo. Doesn't matter how, how much abs you have, a huge knee sometimes does the trick. Because it go, go one cover here. Two. Lacumbo able to kick out, but it is all challenger right now as the champion gets dragged to the center of the ring. Ooh, beautiful dropping elbow. Nevada back into the cover. Go for cover, but didn't hook the leg. Just the two. Nevada looked a little surprised there. I kind of thought that he might just be forcing Lacumbo to exert energy and kick out, but. The confidence of the challenger starting to take over here as again, the, the back, which not so long ago collided with that steel post. And now Nevada. Gonna try uh -oh. to wear down the mighty low combo once again. Fans cheering him on. Can you wear down the combo though? He fights his way back to his feet and now striking. Well, it's like he gets special powers from the fans' cheers. Uh-oh. What? Ah! Sunset flip. Nevada trying to fight out of it. Look, Amo got him down. Counter to, ooh. Ooh, look at that. Straight boot to the, to the head of Locombo. Must be a bunch of vegetarians in this crowd. They don't like the beef. Yeah, it might be a bunch of vegans here. It is Vancouver. Oh, that's true. Nevada. Ooh. With Back precision. Into a submission. Really working the back of the mighty low combo. Gonna take away the low combo. Gonna take away any type of power move by low combo. It's a great strategy. These fans certainly don't like it, but Vance Nevada has put in the work before the match and now is putting in the work during the match. Lacumbo, he might have trouble walking tomorrow if he can at all. All the damage done to his back, specifically the lower back. Oh dear. Gonna go for another backbreaker, oh. sidewalk slam. And we talk about the power of Lacumbo, but that was an impressive physical feat. Now into the cover, could this be it? And Lacumbo very quickly getting that shoulder off the mat. Denzel saying that his big brother will not go out that easy. And I do tend to agree, but we have never seen the champion in this much peril, Al. Oh, oh goodness. Ooh. Almost dropped him on his head, but decided to go for a slam. Once again, working the lower back area of the mighty little combo. Denzel sensing that his brother is in trouble here, trying to get this crowd behind the mighty one again. Mr. Beefy goodness and all of his glory. Oh, La Combo was able to reverse it. Picks him up, drops him down. Could this be Lacombo's opportunity to get back in this matchup? Lacombo firing himself up. Gonna take a lot to get Nevada back on his feet. 
especially with both of them in Lacumbo's hands. And if that is struggling, I don't know what he's trying to do here. Uh oh. Fighting his way out, but to no oh! succession. Oh, face plant. Down goes Nevada. Ooh. And down again. Now for a third time. Lacumbo starting to put a few offensive moves together here, rocking the challenger. And again, into the cover. Could this be it? The champion does not retain. I mean, when you've been in as many championship matches as Vance Nevada, you, you get a sense for the pressure. But I don't know if he's ever felt pressure like this from the Mighty Lacumbo. Nice vertical suplex despite being, uh, having his back worked on the entire match. I don't know if Lacumbo is possible to feel pain at this point. Oh my oh God! Oh my goodness! Standing moonsault by One, Lacumbo. One, two, no! And somehow, Vance Nevada Can't kicked out. Can't kicked out. Holy moly. Absolutely incredible. Oh, wait a minute, on the outside. Denzel sort of got into Vance's face and got knocked out. Gonna go for Lacombo here, wait. Lacombo notices his brother oh, wait a minute. is out. Lacombo maybe taking his eyes off the prize here. Beefy Looking goodness. His brother. One, oh, wait a minute. two, Handful, three. Oh my Unbelievable. goodness. Unbelievable, we have a new champion. Everyone's in shock. Low combo still on his feet. Got surprised by that roll up. Handful of ties by Mr. Beefy Goodness, Vance Nevada. Nobody more surprised than the mighty Low combo. Wait a minute. Low oh, combo. No, hold on. Ooh. Big spine buster by the mighty Low combo. But a new champion. Here, crown tonight at Night of Champions, Mr. Beefy Goodness, the brand new six time ASW Trans Canada Champion. I cannot believe it. Vance Nevada predicted that this was going to happen. Mighty Locomo still in the ring. Still in shock, but wait a minute. That's Nevada with the belt. Oh! Cheap shot by Vance Nevada, your new All Star Wrestling Trans Canada champion. Denzel, sad boy Denzel is down. The mighty low combo is down. Vance Nevada. This does not look like a champion to me, but this is your champion attacking the mighty low combo. Somebody get some help out here. Vance Nevada still not done. Oh, wait a minute. Here comes the thunder from Jalunder. Finally, some help for the mighty low combo. Well, thank God for the thunder from Jalunder. Coming out to help the mighty low combo. Looks like he wants the mic. Well, 
What does the thunder from Jalunder has to say? Well, it looks like he wants Dance Nevada on March 9th for the few English words that he said. Well, the Thunder from Jalunder challenged the new champion, Vance Nevada. But will that match be made? Stay tuned to social media, All-Star Wrestling, AS, at ASW Canada. I hope we see that match right here at the Maritime Labor Center, March the 9th. 